bums and tums. A floor workout to tone bums and tums. But government health warning, don't get down on the floor if you can't get up again safely. Oh, gang, the bums, the legs, the tums. They don't have to be problem areas. You can tone them up. So come down on the floor with us. Let's just work everything, all right? Lying on your back, soles of the feet on the floor, any leg. You're going to bring that knee up into your chest. Put your hands behind the thigh and just ease it down into your chest. Feel that stretch on the hip flexors. Just hold it there. That's real good. OK, let's try the other leg. So place that down gently. Here we go. Other leg lifted up. Just ease that knee down into your chest and feel the stretch in your hip flexors. Just hold it there. That's real good. We've got to do this a few more times. Put that foot down nice and easy. All right, bring the knee up. Ease that down into your chest. And as you get better at doing this, all you have to do is do it without helping it with your hands. So you can just lift the knee up and ease it down when you're ready to get a nice stretch of the hip flexors. That's good. Here we go. We're going to do one more on each side. And bring it up and ease it down. Nice and easy. Oh, dear. Here we go. Put that down. Other leg. Bring it in. This is the last one. That's good. OK. Next thing we're going to do is tilt that pelvis. So what I want to do, make sure the soles of the feet are on the floor. Put your hands to the side. Shoulders are relaxed down. Now, you're going to tuck that belly button underneath the rib cage and at the same time, try and peel away the bottom off the floor and then release it down. It's a very small movement, tucking the belly button underneath the rib cage. Here we go, squeeze it up and then take it down. That's good. Let's try it again. Squeeze it up. Good. Let it down. You're doing well. Come on, let's do it again. Here we go. Bring it up. Release it up. Oops. So it's a pelvic tilt. Squeeze it and release it. Good. Let's do it again. Two more times. Here we go. Bring it up. Tuck in the belly button underneath the rib cage. Peeling off the butt off the floor. Release it. Good. We've got one more to do. Here we go. Bring it up. Good. All the way up and hold it there. Five, six. Keep breathing, keep breathing, keep living, keep doing it, release. I want to do one more for luck, squeeze up. Good, and hold it there for eight, and eight, and seven, and six. Keep breathing, five, and four, and three, and two. Oh, and let it out. Does not feel good? Good, here we go. Now, next thing we're going to do, both knees are going to do some work now. But we're going to separate it, first of all, to make it nice and easy for you. So keep your hands by the side. Let one leg fall to the side. OK, good. Now let the other leg follow. Keep the knees together as it gets, uh, gets down there. Hold it there. Good. Feel that stretch. Now bring it up. You're reversing everything. So bring the top leg up. Bring the other one up. We're going down to the other side. Let the knee go down to the floor. Very good. Now let the other one follow. Hold it there. Feel that stretch. That's so good. OK, good. Come back up to the middle. If that's too easy for you, because I know you're getting fit, all you have to do now is let both knees fall down to the side. Control. Stomach tight. Hold it there. Good. Feel that stretch. Here we go. Coming up to the middle. Contract the stomach muscles. Lift it up. Good. Hold it there. Now we're going to the other side. Oh, my. It's good. I like it. Come on, let it down. You can do it. Here we go. Coming up to the middle. Come up. Good, we've got to do two more each side. Here we go, bring it down. Oh, 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 it's so good for me, bring it up. That's good, here we go, and take it down. Remember, at any time, if you need to have a rest, you can do it. Here we go, last time, one on each side, take it down. Stomach is tight as we hold this and control it. Bring it up to the top, last time, the other side. Here we go, take it down. Very good, bring it up. That's good. OK, relax. Take a breather. You're doing good. OK, this time we're going to do our whole lower body lift. So make sure the soles of the feet are on the floor. Knees are slightly apart. Hands by your side. Now what you want to do is you've got to lift the whole lot up. That's good. Now hold it there. Squeeze your butt, your cheeks together. Good. And release it. Bring it down. Let's try this again. Here we go. Come up to the top. Hold it there. Squeeze the cheeks together. The stomach is tight. Control it. It's good for you. Keep breathing. 
Good. Release that. Taking it down. We've got to do four more. Here we go. Bring it up and up. Good. Now squeeze the cheeks together. I can feel it working. Dimples in my bum. Here I come. You can do it. Hold it there. Take it down. Come on, down. Okay, come on. Three more to go. Bring it up. Here we go. Go up. Squeeze it nice and tight. Squeeze the thighs together. The stomach is tight. Everything is tight. Keep breathing. Take it down. We got two more. Here we go. Ready. Lift it up. Lift it up. Up. Nice and slow. Control. That's what it's all about. The core muscles are working. Hold it there. Release that. Take it down. We got one more. You can do it. Here we go. Bring it up. Come on. Up. Oh my goodness. It's working for me. Hold it there. Okay, for eight counts. Eight and seven and six. Keep breathing. Five and four and three and two and rest. Put it down. Oh my goodness, didn't you do good there? Mm -hmm. Okay, here's what I'll do now. Want to get up? All right. Want to turn over onto all fours? Here we go. You're on all fours. Safety points are real important here. Make sure the hands are directly underneath the shoulder blades. Make sure the knees are underneath the hips so you're supporting yourself. Knees slightly apart from that position. Let the belly hang down without moving the back. So just drop it down. I wish I could do this. Okay, now tighten it. Tuck your belly button underneath the rib cage so the back is nice and flat. The stomach is tight. It feels good. It's tight. You can even check it by thumping your stomach away. Hold it there. Good. Release that. Here we go. Let's try it again. Bring it in. Oh, my goodness. My stomach is so flat. I look so good. Everybody's jealous. Release it. Good. Let's try it again. Here we go. Bring it up. Look at the hair, the way it falls forward after all that wonderful makeup. Here we go. Release it. That's good. Here we go. One more time. Bring it up. Bring it up. Oop. Keep on breathing. Good. Keep the back nice and flat and still. Release that. Actually, one more time for love. Here we go. Bring it up. Bring it up. Good. And release that. Oh, my goodness. Now, going back to the safety position, let's double check that we're in the right place. Make sure the hands are directly underneath the shoulder blades. Make sure that your knees are underneath your hips. All right? Good. Now hold up there. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to bring any knee up to your chest. So you bring the knee forward, stomach tight, and then you push it out behind you. That's real good. Point the toes, hold it there. Stomach tight. Bring it forward again. Here we go. Bring it forward. Good. And push it out. Good. Now, if that's real difficult, you can actually take it easy here. You can bring it forward up to your chest, and then you can slide it along the carpet, the floor, all the way out. Hold it there, stomach tight. Let's try it again. Bring it forward. Oh, my. And slide it. Here we go. Good. Bring your knees back to that safe position. Hold it there. We're going to try the other leg. Ready? Here we go. So take a breather. You're doing good. All right? Remember, at any time, if you need to have a rest, you have a rest. No problem. Press the pause button. That's all you have to do. Okay, the other leg. Contract the stomach muscles. Relax the shoulders just a little bit, all right? Bend the elbows. Don't lock them out. Here we go. Bring the knee forward. Now, push it out, 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 out. Hold it there. It's working the butt. It's working everywhere. Hold it there. Bring it forward. And remember, you can always take it easy from here. You can slide it along the floor. Good. Very good. And bring it in again. Here we go. Bring the knee forward and push it out. Good. Let's try it again. One more time. Bring it up. Good. And slide it out. Bring it forward. Put the knee in that safe position. Just relax for a moment. Let it rest. Take a breather. All right. You're doing good. Okay. Here we go. Next thing we're going to do. Again, double check that you're in the right position. Stomach nice and tight. Hands underneath those shoulders. All right. This time, what I want you to do is you just take an arm and stretch it out in front of you like so. So any arm. Hold it out. That's good. Hold it there. Oh, my goodness. Feel it working through the shoulders. Keep your stomach tight and relax that down. Let's try the other hand. Push it forward, the other hand. Reaching forward. Very good. And come back. Let's try it again. Here we go. Other hand. Reach forward. My, this is great for control of those core muscles. Here we go. Pushing forward. Keeping yourself nice and aligned. Also working every muscle. That's what we're doing. Okay, one more each side. Here we go. Reach forward. That's good. Feel it there. All right. And take it back. Last time. Here we go. Reach forward. Good. And rest it a moment. Take a breather. Doing real good. Okay. Remember, if you need a drink, go and have a drink. All right. Here we go. We're going to the legs. Doing the same thing. Starting with any leg, we're going to push it out behind you. 
straight out behind you and hold it. Oh my, oh my. Just hold it there and relax that down. Good, the other leg. Out behind you and hold it. Feel the stomach tight. The butt is tight. Just hold up there, point the toes. Relax that down. We're gonna do one more on each. Here we go. Out behind you, hold it there. Good, hold it nice and tight. Good, come back. Last time, the other side. Push it out behind you and hold it. Hold it there, feel the butt working. Good. Now here is the real test, if it's working. You're gonna try and do opposite hand and opposite leg at the same time. So let's check our safety position first of all. Knees directly underneath the hips. Hands underneath the shoulder blades. Bend the elbows slightly. Take any hand, push that out. Now lift the opposite leg up. Oh my goodness, if you fall over, you can lie down and just have a rest for a moment. And then go back in and try it again. Relax that down, hold it for as long as you can. Here we go, opposite hand, opposite leg. Here we go, push it out. Oh, we are doing so good. We've got to do one more on each. Here we go, come back. Starting position, here we go, go forward. Reach forward, good, you're doing well. Hold it there. That's good, one more, the other side. Ready, let's push up. Hold it there, hold it there, hold it there, hold it there, hold it there. Very good, very good, put that down. Here's all you've got to do is sit back onto your heels and then transfer your butt and your weight all over to one side. Like so, good. And then try transferring the weight over to the other side. Oh, that's good. Oh, I can feel that stretching my butt muscle. Oh my goodness, that feels good. Let's try it again, I'm loving this. Here we go. Oh, oh, hold it there. Let it stretch, let it stretch. Good, one more, the other side. Push it down and hold it there, let it stretch. Oh my goodness. And you know what? You need to sit down. You need to cross your legs. You need to think to yourself, I need to do some relaxation. But you can do that anytime you like because those relaxation exercises are really good for you. That was real good toning of the bums, the legs, the thumbs. Do it as many times as you like. Listen to your body. They need an applause. You need an applause. Well done, gang.